Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have another tag video for you guys and this one is the very popular YouTube tag, the common white girl tag. And I thought this would be like the perfect tag for me to do because I'm really not that much of a typical white girl. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. If Before I get started, if any of you are interested in doing this tag, all the questions will be listed down below. And another thing, no, I did not get a boob job. I'm just wearing a really good push-up bra, and it's it's nice to feel like I have boobs. I like it. It looks... Finally, I know what it's like to be a girl. Question number one is, what is your favorite Starbucks drink? And my favorite Starbucks drinks is none. I actually do not like Starbucks. I don't like coffee. I don't like anything from Starbucks. I've even tried a couple of their teas, and I don't know. I'm just... I just don't really like Starbucks. I don't really see the hype with Starbucks like that every... Every person loves Starbucks. It's hard to find someone who doesn't, but yeah, I'm just not really into the whole kind of Starbucks thing. I don't know. The second question is, how long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Uh, usually, if it's a day where I'm not filming or a day where I'm not doing anything, I just roll out of bed and call it good. I really don't do anything special. Like, if... If any of my subscribers meet me like out in public like at the store or anything like that usually when you meet me I will have no makeup on and my hair will be in a bun and I'll be in sweatpants like it, I really don't I don't look like this every day like I do this maybe a couple times a week just to make myself feel good usually not long at all but if I am getting ready to like you know film or go out you know like to the mall or out with friends or family or whatever I'm doing usually about an hour or less 45 minutes to an hour I really don't do anything special I just do my makeup you know how I always do it and just clip my extensions in if I want to put something comfortable on and go I really don't I don't spend that much time getting ready at all question number three is how many selfies do you take in a day um it depends it depends how good I look good I look I guess if I'm like you know having a good hair day or a good makeup day or just a good day in general I take maybe about between 5 to 15 selfies a day depending on my mood but if I'm just like chilling out like just none I don't know I it, it has to be like a good day like that's like if I post a selfie on Instagram or Twitter you know that was a good day but you know not too many I'm not like selfie obsessed but you know if I'm having a good day I take quite a few Question number four is how many Instagram followers and pics do you have? And I'm on Instagram right now and right now I have um, how many Instagram followers? I have 4,900 Instagram followers and my pictures I have 872 pictures. That's a lot of pictures so yes that is that is what it is. Question number five is do you ever say OMG or LOL out loud? No? <laughs> uh, do people do that? Like, uh, no, I do not uh, say those words out loud. I mean, I have before, like, on the case of, like, making fun of people who do that, but no, I've never actually been like, OMG, or anything. No. No, no, no. Question number six is, do you ever wear the same clothing item more than once? Hell yes, I do. If you have been subscribed to me for a long time, you've probably seen the same shirt at least five different times. Like, I always wear the same clothes. I'm always wearing the same band tees. I'm always wearing the same something. So, definitely yes. For those, for those people who can afford to do that, like, that's good for you. But no, I do not do that. I always wear the same thing more than once. Question number seven. Are you racist? What, is, what does that question have to do with this tag? Like, at all? That doesn't even make sense. Question number eight is how many tweets do you have? And I have 7,295 tweets. Number nine, Instagram, Twitter, or Tumblr? That's really hard because I really love Instagram and I really love Tumblr. Twitter is like okay, I use it like every day at least, but you know, it's not a big deal if I ever lost it. So between Instagram and Tumblr, probably Instagram because I have so many pictures on there, so many pictures of my dogs, you know, good memories. So definitely Instagram for me. Question number 10 is what do you spend most of your time doing? Um, literally YouTube, YouTube, and YouTube. I literally, I like, I make YouTube my whole life. I absolutely love YouTube. It's something I really enjoy doing. I'm either editing, filming, planning videos, buying stuff for videos. Like, 
literally everything I do is for YouTube. So yes, that's literally, that's like a legit answer to that question. Like YouTube is what I'm doing. Number 11 is who are your favorite YouTubers? I have covered this before, but it is Pink Sparkles, Morgan Joyce, Shan XO, Julia Graff, and see, there it goes on the spot. I can't think of the other one. Question number 12 is how often do you do your nails? And this is actually a really, really good question because as of like the last um, six, six to eight months, I have been really, really getting into nails and stuff. And if you guys remember, my friend Amy sent me a whole bunch of makeup products and nail products to try. And ever since then, I do my nails at least maybe once a week or once every two weeks, either changing up the color because my nails are a lot healthier now. So I'm usually just changing the color. If any of you are wondering, this color is Tulip Garden by Madame Glam. Just looks like that. Really pretty kind of nude color. I just did that a couple days ago. Um, yeah, so I'm usually always changing the color at least once a week or every two weeks or something along those lines. Question number 13 is, are you a shopaholic? Definitely not. I usually, when I go shopping, I'm either getting dog food, toilet paper, food for myself. Definitely do not go shopping often at all. The number one reason is being no money. I can't you know, go out and just go shopping all the time. You know, I pay half the rent here. I pay the electric, I pay the cable, I pay for all the dog stuff, like their vet bills and their dog food. I pay for all of that. So yeah, I don't have any extra money to go out and go shopping all the time. That's why a lot of people ask me, they're always like, how come you don't ever do any hauls? And the reason being, because I never have any money to, you know, go out and buy stuff for hauls. So I did do a Halloween decoration haul, but that's because everything was like a dollar and I could afford that. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm definitely not a shopaholic at all. You know how usually it's the bigger sister that gives the little sister the hand-me-downs? Not in my case, it's reverse. Like the little sister gives, my little sister gives me all of her clothes because she has more money. She doesn't live on her own, so she doesn't really have like any bills or anything. So she has more money to go out and shop. So usually she'll give me clothes she doesn't want anymore, like this shirt. Question number 14 is how many times have you watched Mean Girls? Well, when it first came out, I went and saw it in theaters with a really close friend at the time. And ever since then, I didn't see it. Then my mom got it for me on DVD for I believe it was Christmas. Um, I've probably seen it a good 15 to 20 times maybe, um, which is a lot. So I do know quite a lot of the lines in the movie. I haven't, I don't have like the whole movie memorized, but I have a pretty good chunk of it memorized. So yeah, about 15 to 20 times or more. Maybe there's like a time I'm not thinking of, but I did watch that movie three times in one day once though. So that's kind of like drastic. Number 15 is do you own a lot of clothes? Um, I mean, it. I guess it depends on what you call a lot. I mean, if you go look in my closet right now, it, it would look like I have a lot, but when you start like getting things out, I really don't have that many clothes. I would say I own the right amount of clothes. Question number 16 is, do you take pictures of food before you eat it? I have done that before, yes, yeah, so I am guilty of that, but no, I do not do it every single time. Just on special occasions, like if the pizza looks really good, I'm gonna take a picture of it. Or if I cook something and I'm proud of it, I'm gonna take a picture of it. So it depends, I have done it before though, yes. Question number 17 is, do you wear makeup every day? No way, oh my gosh, no way guys. Like I said earlier, if you ever meet me in public, you'll most likely run into me when I don't have any makeup on. So no, I do not wear makeup every day. I just, there's no point in it. You know, I used to struggle with really bad acne and I found the best way to calm, you know, the blemishes are to calm down on the makeup wearing. So I wear makeup maybe a maximum of one to four times a week and that's it. That, that's really all I wear. Um, sometimes I have gone close to a month without wearing makeup so yeah I no 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 number 18 is what are what are your average grades in school well I'm not in school anymore I graduated like two and a half years ago now which is crazy but um, and I didn't go to college or anything but if I can remember correctly I think usually my grades were from B's to D's except I had two A's. I always had an A in English and I always had an A in forensic science. Like I loved those classes so much. Oh, English, I miss English class so much. Oh, I just loved that class. So I always had an A in there. I really enjoyed forensics my senior year. So I always had an A in there as well, but everything else was like a C or a D. So just kind of like in between, I guess. I had some good ones and I had some bad ones. Let's just say that. Um, and in better words, let's just say I shouldn't have graduated. <laughs> Number 19 is how do you usually style your hair? 
Um, you're looking at one of the ways. Usually when I'm going out or filming or something like that, I will have my extensions in, either just the blonde ones or I will put in these black ones or my burgundy ones. So I'll either do that or I will have my hair in like a high bun or in a ponytail or just down naturally. Um, I don't ever do anything special with my hair. I don't ever use heat on my hair. I think I use heat on my hair maybe once a month, if that. Like I just, I never use heat on my hair. So my hair is usually just doing, you know, whatever. And I like it like that, it's, it's easy. The very last question of this tag, question number 20 is, do you always look presentable? And the answer to that is probably not. I mean, you're not gonna see me go to the store looking like this all the time. Like I said, I'll be in sweat pants, a baggy t-shirt, hair in a bun, and no makeup. Like, that is literally how I like to be. Like, I, I love makeup and everything. I really, really do. I enjoy it. I would be lost if I didn't have my makeup. But then again, I'm not dependent on it. Like, if I have to go to the store and I'm breaking out everywhere and looking like crap, I'll go out because I really, I just don't care. I'm not like the kind of person who has to look good. I used to be that way, but now I'm just like, eh, I don't really care. Let's just go. Hey everybody, so that was everything for this common white girl tag. How do you think I did? Did I answer some of the questions differently than what you thought I was going to answer them? Let me know in the comments. I thought this tag would be really fun to try out and also another way for you guys to kind of get to know me better. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure to share, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I would really appreciate it. And as usual, and of course, I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye guys. Whew, this shirt gives me major boobage. <laughs> Woo!